From the man who wrote The Usual Suspects comes the latest for Tom Cruise. Hi, I'm Nancy Jay with the Celebrity Spotlight on Jack Reacher, a great thriller with enough twists to keep you guessing and to keep you asking, who is Jack Reacher? For the answer, I go straight to the source. How do you describe Jack Reacher? Because we don't really know very much about him. No, but you we're had not. to write him. Yes, I had to write him, and I had to decide how much of that I was going to tell. Um, uh, Describing who he is, uh, he's a former military investigator who was born on military bases abroad, spent his entire life living abroad, and uh, the only time he ever lived in the U.S. was during his time at West Point. And now that he's retired from the military, he's come home and is sort of looking for the America he was raised to believe was out there. And as a result, he's never settled down. He has no driver's license, no cell phone, no email, uh, no fixed address. Um, nothing but his passport and a folding toothbrush in his pocket. And that sort of lifestyle gets him in and out of trouble. That's what I like about this movie is we really, we, we don't have to know too much. No, do not really. Yeah, he's, it, you know, he is the old school character, you know, sort of of the, the, the older Steve McQueen variety. Uh, you know, Steve McQueen used to say, my character doesn't learn, my character knows. And we really love the idea that we were not burdened by a character arc and that we were, that this character really has no baggage, literal or otherwise. Jack Reacher is a ghost served in the military police. A brilliant investigator. Troublemaker, too. Then, two years ago, he disappears. You don't find this guy unless he wants to be found. Excuse me, sir. There's a Jack Reacher here to see you. Can I help you? James Barr. You say he shot five people. I don't believe he did. Well, what exactly are you saying? He was framed. So what does an army cop do mostly? What you do? It's one minor difference. Every suspect was a trained killer. What do we hope to find? The truth. Soldier is asking questions no one else would ask. Get the lawyer. Helen? No. Helen, are you hurt? Do I have to tell you how this works? Do you think I'm a hero? I am not a hero. The lawyer's all yours. On second thought, I'd like to kill you. They want me to run. And I'm gonna finish this. You're a little rusty, Mr. Reacher. I have nothing to lose. And if you're smart, that scares you. He doesn't care about the law. He doesn't care about proof. He only cares about what's right. I I enjoy the fact that we're never quite, sh besides not knowing who Jack Reacher really is, we're really not quite sure who's good and who's bad. Good guys, you know, it's, which is, is really nice. Well, thank you. Uh, yes, that was, um, it, what I like to do is I like to make a movie so that you come back, watch it the second time, and see a completely different movie. And that's a testament to the actors in the film. There's a, there's a lot of nuance and a lot of little things, a lot of little messages they're, they're communicating that, that come out the second time. Around. What I like about Jack Reacher, obviously Tom Cruise, but you're never really quite sure who's good and who's bad. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well done in that regard. Yeah, we, we don't want to patronize the audience. We, we, we want them to stay interested because they are, like him, forced to be inquisitive. You know, we're not just presenting them with two-dimensional characters that they go, oh, I know what's going on. Oh, I can tell what's going to happen. You know, that this is very much not that movie. And there are some red herrings and, you know, we give them some paths to go down which are probably the wrong paths. And, you know, that's what I think this this film kind of dignifies an audience and you sense that, you know, the audience are pleased to be made to think and and they, they get a thrill ride, but they also get to think and I think that's a winning combination really. Now that's entertainment. Look for Jack Reacher in your real time theater.